written. And guess what? We have a composer in the house tonight, and we want to talk about him. Uh, his name is Jimmy Horan, and we're going to bring him out right now. He's part of the of the the choir. Jimmy, where are you? There you are. Hi, come over here. Applaud, applaud like wild. Hey, how are you? I'm well. How are you? Doing? I'm so happy you're here. I'm happier. Thanks. Right, well, tell me, tell me what you what you've written a brand new musical. But first of all, let me just say he's an attorney. First of all, but, but don't hold that against me. I'm still pretty nice. I, I really am. No, but but um, you've written a new musical. I have. I've been working on a story that's intrigued me for a lot of years about the composer Frederick Chopin and a romance that he had in the 1800s with a female writer uh, named George Sand. And the reason that she was named George was because her scandal, her novels were so scandalous that she could not uh, publish them in uh, a female name. So she uh, walked around in men's clothing. There's some question about their sexuality. There's dysfunctional families. It's nothing I know about, mm -hmm. but I still. <laughs> I, I, I know, I was just seeing a couple of Georges Sands in the house. <laughs> no, but uh, <laughs> but you, you've written this gorgeous thing uh, in, in between going to law school, being an attorney, and playing piano at Marie's Crisis. Uh, in, that <laughs> in, that <laughs> in that order, actually. <laughs> but, well, uh, yeah. Tell me about, you're, we're gonna, the, the guys are going to sing one of your songs. Well, I have to tell you that it is an amazing honor just to sing with these boys. And once you get to know them, it's an honor to, to be in their family. But... To have them uh, do an original song of mine is beyond um, words, I can't even tell you. So I know how George felt when she sang this song, but, um, and to have it in Charlie Beale's hands and the boys behind me, um, somebody pinch me. Oh, come on. But, um, in any really, somebody pinch him. Come up and. <laughs> <laughs> Anyhow, what's happening in this song is uh, George has just seen Frederick uh, perform a concert and she's smitten with him. She's falling in love with him, clearly. And she's, she doesn't know that. Um, and just like Richard Rogers said, uh, when they can't speak, they need to sing. So uh, what happens in, in his music is that um, in response to questions about how could she love this or be falling in love with this shy man when she's such a flamboyant character, she says, you don't see what I see in him. Um, one word makes me not be able to, to, to carry on. So uh, in his music is about the um, romance that she sees within uh, Frederick Chopin. So we know that she's falling in love and she doesn't know it yet. So that's what's going on here. So thank you. So this is In His Music, written by Jimmy.